Bé, prim, primer ple al Parlament Europeu. Ja tenim president, després de que la gran coalició l'escollís per sobre de tot i de, i de tota la resta de formacions polítiques. I ahir vam tenir a Mario Renzi, que va presentar el seu programa de treball en, a la, en el ple del Parlament Europeu. Un ple de treball que, francament, ens va decepcionar, eh, davant d'un discurs molt amable i molt, eh, i molt ben estructurat i molt culte, però de contingut pràcticament res, eh, el que augura una presidència italiana més, av més aviat fluixa. Avui estic amb Filip Lambers, Filip Lambers és el nou portaveu del, del grup eh, Verds Aliança Lliure Europea. Estem, eh, estic molt content que ho sigui ell perquè és un vell amic meu. I ahir va fer la seva primera intervenció precisament eh, interpel·lant Mateo Renzi sobre el seu programa, sobre la presidència i sobre les coses que ell plantejava. I per tant, eh, li vull donar la paraula perquè explico una mica ahir com va anar la, com va anar la cosa. Filip, yesterday you had your first speech in plenary, yeah. eh, in front of Mateo Renzi. So, What was your evaluation of it? Well, the guy can certainly speak in public, no doubt. He, yeah. he can really deliver very flamboyant speeches. Problem is that there was nothing in it. Mm. I mean, nothing on tackling the energy independence uh, of Europe, mm. on en energy union, almost mm. nothing, mm. on social union, which is really burning. And that guy is coming from Italy, mm. a country which has huge debt and which has uh, high unemployment. Mm. Well, no concrete initiatives, there's this proposal of uh, an unemployment benefit scheme at European level, not a word on it. Mm. Uh, it, it was an empty speech, so, so mm. very nice show, uh, but probably I don't need a second one if there's no action behind it. Yeah, well that was a bit the impression that all, all of us got it. Well, especially coming from a uh, Prime Minister of the South, some of us were expecting to address some fundamental issues, like as you said, unemployment, reform of the Eurozone, for instance. Yeah. Fiscal policy and uh, uh, an important shift on fiscal policy. There was actually nothing on that. No, he just said that we have a stability and growth pact. We have stability now. We uh, we need to have growth. But well, saying that is yeah. is, is saying nothing. I mean, yeah. he didn't say how we want to reform the uh, economic governance of Europe, mm -hmm. uh, and this is what we need to change if if we want to say goodbye to austerity. Yeah, no, no, absolutely. Well, in any case, we will have to see uh, in what the next six years. At the end, on the, uh, in December, we'll have to evaluate. But. Si hem, de viure, si hem de començar una mica a avaluar les, la, el programa de la presidència italiana pel que vam sentir les perspectives, de veritat, no són massa bones i els verds, en tot cas, seguirem plantejant les qüestions que creiem que són importants per aquests propers sis mesos.